When a rapper dies, it garners a great deal of public and media interest. This is especially true if they died young, as people are often surprised when someone dies before their time. Let's see some rappers who became more famous after passing away. Number 5. Pop Smoke Pop Smoke popularized the Brooklyn drill subgenre of hip-hop. According to The Ringer, the sound combines eerie British production methods with trap beats and frequently grim lyrics. He published his first significant effort, Meet the Woo, in 2019, with the follow-up, Meet the Woo 2, which debuted in February 2020 and peaked at number 7 on the Billboard album list. His star was rising, and he'd go on to collaborate with strong hitters like Travis Scott and Nicki Minaj, as well as score several top 20 singles between 2010 and 2021, including For the Night, What You Know About Love, The Woo, and Mood Swings. Pop Smoke, born Basher Jackson, would unfortunately not live to see much of his tremendous achievement. According to the New York Times, the rapper had moved from New York to a Hollywood mansion he rented from Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. Actress Teddy Mellencamp, a group of men allegedly stormed in and shot the rapper there in the early hours of February 19, 2020. He died a few hours later in a nearby hospital. Pop Smoke was 20 years old at the time. According to the BBC, three men and two teens were eventually caught and charged with robbery and murder. Number 4. Juice World There were few rappers who had a greater influence on hip-hop in the late 2010s than Jared Anthony Higgins, better known as Juice World. In 2018, he released his debut album, Goodbye and Good Riddance, which peaked at number 4 on the Billboard 200, as well as the massive smash songs Lucid Dreams and All the Girls Are the Same. His second studio album, Death Race for Love, fared even better, peaking at number one on the Billboard 200. Juice World was a prolific musician who released nine extended plays and two mixtapes before the age of 21. Then, little than a week after reaching that landmark birthday, Juice World's career was ended. TMZ reports that the rapper stepped off a private plane at Chicago's Midway Airport in December 2019. He had a seizure while going through the terminal, and blood was reportedly gushing out of his mouth by the time paramedics arrived. He was pronounced dead at a hospital a few hours later. According to the Cook County Medical Examiner, the rapper, whose songs were riddled with references to his use and misuse of narcotics, died from an overdose of codeine and oxycodone. Number 3. XXX Tenashin According to Vulture, Jose Anfoy, better known as XXX Tenashin, broke out on the digital hip-hop underground of sound cloud in 2014 when he was only 16 years old, publishing a series of songs and albums on the service. Within three years, he had major Billboard pop chart successes, including Look At Me and Jocelyn Floors, with non-SoundCloud albums 17 and reaching number two and number one, respectively. According to Rolling Stone, his music was urgent and replete with tales of severe violence and fights with mental illness. XXX Tentation's life was perhaps much more turbulent and violent away from the microphone. He allegedly beat his love partner in 2016, threatening to cut off her tongue because she was performing someone else's tunes. This case was never settled because XXX Tentation was assassinated in June 2018 in Florida. The rapper was 20 years old. Number 2. Notorious Big Biggie Smalls, Biggie, Big Papa, and Frank White were all nicknames for the Notorious Big. His real name was Christopher George Ladder Wallace, and he was born in Brooklyn, New York, on May 21, 1972. He is widely regarded as one of the best rappers of all time. He began his career in 1992, although his debut album, Ready to Die, was not released until 1994. At this point, he had established himself as a key figure in the East Coast hip hop scene. In 1997, he began work on his second album. Unfortunately, his career in music was cruelly cut short when he was slaying in a drive-by shooting in Los Angeles on March 9, 1997. His second album, Life After Death, was released posthumously only 16 days later. Number 1. Tupac Shakur Tupac Shakur was born on June 16, 1971, in East Harlem, New York. He was also known by the stage aliases Tupac and Mac Avely. This rapper, poet, an actor debuted in 1987. He had a fantastic solo career and is widely regarded as the greatest rapper of all time. Shakur also had a very successful acting career, appearing in six domes. Despite his success, his involvement in hip-hop competition and gang battles harmed his career. 
on September 7, 1996. He was shot in a drive-by shooting in Las Vegas, ending his career. He was shot four times and was taken to the hospital to be treated for his injuries. He passed away six days later on September 13, 1996. And with that being said, it's time to end our video. Who among them is still your favorite? Let us know in the comments. Like this video and make sure to subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos like this. We'll see you in the next video.